In this video, you'll add text from your event plan and arrange it on the page. Make sure to include all of the information your attendees will need. Change the site layout to find what works best for your event and content. Also, be mindful about the kinds of information you share. Your site will be available to anyone on the internet. Keep this in mind as you decide what to include. Do not include personal information like your phone number or address. To get your event details, open your event plan from Google Drive in a separate tab or window. Copy and paste the event details. Highlight the text and select Copy. Return to your site. Insert a text box. Then paste the information. Now, all of your information appears on the website. But because it is all in one text box, you don't have much control over the layout. To give yourself more control, add text to different text boxes. Then you can move the text boxes around the page. Adjust the width of each text box and shift the text to the left, right, or center. You'll recognize these functions from your work in Google Drawings, Google Docs, and lots of other software programs. Next, choose a theme for your website. Themes are like templates. They provide preset options like colors, font styles, and other design elements. Choose a theme that works best for your event and site layout. Next, preview your site. Google Sites automatically adjusts the layout and formatting to fit on other devices like phones and tablets. Preview how your website will look on multiple devices. Click the X to exit preview. Once you've added and formatted the details for your event, Move on to the next video to create a new page with a map. Now it's your turn. Add text from your event plan into text boxes. Choose a theme and preview for different devices. Then move on to the next video to add another page.